Hello, my name is Dr. Harry Callis, and I am one of the pediatric critical care physicians at Valley Children's Hospital. I am also the medical director of the Extracorporeal Life Support Program. Many of you may not know what Extracorporeal Life Support, or ECMO, is. ECMO is a technology that is applied to our most critically ill patients to try to improve their chances of survival. It involves a technology where we drain blood from the body and pass it through an artificial heart lung machine to help rest those organs and to give the children an opportunity to recover from their grave illness. As part of this effort, we brought together over 100 people, physicians, surgeons, cardiac catheterization, operating room staff, nurses, respiratory therapists, social workers, chaplains, an entire array of people, all with one goal in mind, how to apply this technology safely and effectively to our most critically ill children. At Valley Children's Hospital, we've been doing ECMO for over 15 years, primarily in our cardiothoracic surgery patients. I can't emphasize more how much a team effort it takes to cannulate a patient for ECMO. It involves both cath lab uh, staff, because we're using cath type of techniques, but also the operating room staff. And so it is important to have a cohesive team involving uh, our two departments in a safe uh, cannulation of these patients. In order to practice in a protected environment where people have the opportunity to learn and make mistakes in a safe place, simulation is an excellent utilization of resources. So by the time we are interfacing with real patients, we have limited amounts of error, have had uh, time to perfect our practice and deliver effective, efficient care to our sickest patients. I'd like to sincerely thank Valley Children's Hospital and all its donors for the support that they have provided us. Without that, none of this would be possible. With ECMO, we are truly saving lives that would otherwise be lost.